Hey there gamers, it's your friend Mutton Chris from Mutton Bashers, and now as E3 comes to a close, I would like to make a special video in regards to Nintendo's biggest fuck up ever. So, this happened, and I was so excited. We finally get that gritty HD full on Zelda experience we were teased about in E3 2012. Please take a look at how the game looks on screen. And this is what we get. Now I'm sorry Miyamoto, I can't hear what you're saying about all the new features and innovative game concepts over this blatant betrayal of the fandom. Remember the E3 2012 Zelda demo? That was just beautiful. And after years of shitty Looney Tunes graphics, we were promised a full, realistic Zelda game. Did you know it's been 14 years? since the last realistic Zelda game. I'm talking about Majora's Mask, which Nintendo, hello, still needs to remake. I mean, what the fuck could they be doing with their time? Lazy fucks. And no, Twilight Princess does not count because you use the stupid waggle stick. What is this? A fucking kid's game? Oh. <laughs> and seriously. Bloom. Fucking Bloom. Yeah, Nintendo actually using art direction to push the hardware capabilities. Fucking disgraceful. One out of ten. But anyway, back to this year's E3. Yeah, they show some shitty video of a robot chasing Link. Oh, wait! <laughs> He's not wearing green? Or his hat? Way to shove a thorned dildo up our asses, Nintendo. In fact, I'm not even sure if Link is a guy! When will Nintendo stop changing the tired Zelda formula and get back to what the fans really want? Realism. Nintendo need to stop with this cartoony shit and get back to its roots. All this art direction shit just confuses me. I need photorealism and long, boring temples. So, Nintendo, if you're watching this, please, for the fans, save Zelda. Scrap this. Make this. Oh. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe, where next week I'll be whining about Pac Man being in Smash Brothers. What is this fucking Atari bullshit? <laughs>